What's going on guys? I hope everyone's having a good day. I'm actually going to make this video today talking about something that is kind of old, but the Marshalls. They did just recently have a nerf, but I think these things are pretty still, pre are still pretty, pretty powerful. And um, I'm basically just going to show you guys how to use them. I went off with them kind of, I know I have a sniper out right now for some odd reason, but... I switch up to him. I think it, the setup was two marshals and a sniper. And I was trying to get some. I could not quick scope. I was trying to learn how to do it. I was like, what's a better time than now? Just to try to whoop out the old uh, locust and try to get some shots. More nothing but hit markers. Worse than the ballista, in my opinion. But then again, that's why I had the marshals. <laughs> so, um. Man, I just got laid out. <laughs> but how are you going to... These things are decent by themselves, I guess, if you don't have anything on them. But they're still not the great. You can put on long barrel and laser and fast... Or, yeah, long barrel and laser. That might help. Or fast mags and long barrel. That's something that's going to make these things epic alone. But if you just put on, like, a... Sing, or yeah, for a single, that's what I mean when I say alone. They're a great secondary. But adding dual wheel to these things and just shoot one. You might need two, but... Even if you go for one shot if you're coming down on someone and you know you're too far, um, just shoot one and then you can shoot the other one if you need to. Or um, if you know you have to, you can just double pop them and you're going to get a one shot kill. But try to keep it as kill one person per the two slugs and one of the marshals. Just take out one at a time and you're going to be able to conserve your energy. You're going to get a pattern going and you can go on high streaks with it, especially if you're out in the back. I know I didn't do it too great right here, but later on in the video, I do do so with them. And, um, I'm actually going to mention something else. The marshals were great. Everyone's kind of complained because they were nerfed with range and stuff. But you also got to remember, when the marshals were pre-nerf, whenever these things were epic, they were not just a secondary. They were a primary. They were probably one of the best primaries that I ever had. One of the best primaries, out of the shotguns at least. I mean, I used to go on Nuketown right here, and I'd drop 50, 40, 40, 50 kills easily and go positive. I would just go on huge streaks with these things. I think I even got a GI unit on Nuketown with them once, and I don't even do that with the regular guns, but it was it, they're pretty freaking good still. But now I feel like they're where they need to be in balancing. It's it's not too OP'd. It kind of fits in with other pistols. It's not just got all pros. It has cons to it now, especially when it is dual wield because that is the OP detachment everyone thought that I mentioned. But, like I said, just use them as a secondary now. Put them on a sniper class, an assault rifle class. You can only add, you can also add one to it, so you can just pull it out and pop it. You can still run around with these as primaries, but you're not going to do as great as you did before. So I do do keep that in mind. Um, that's all I had to say for today's video. If you did like it, leave a like. Subscribe to the channel for more awesome daily content every day or every other day. Um, Check me out on Twitter. It's in the description. You can stay in touch on social media such via Twitter. That's what I was talking about. It's in the description and under the channel art. That's all I had for today. It's been good, guys. See you in the next video.